out of here. Alright, I'm gonna get some delicious. Anyways, hey, everybody. Yeah, I'm in here. Let's get some more dang on Rumpa into this fucking mix. I'm eating some thick ass steak. While I'm playing. Hot shit. Good shit. I don't know how many coins I have on me. Zero? Alright. Alright, let's continue. Alright, what gifts do we got? Going out the keto girl. I don't know why he's doing that. Anyways, nope, that's the school rules. The first one's the map. And there's a keto girl. No way, just goddamn it. It is the long way. The fast travel was the long way. Alright, where are you, bitch? Oh, her room. Duh. Nope. I hit it when it skips. I got something in the back. Who's in my motor video? No, I can't. It'd be fun random on a Mr. Rap. I'm draining out Tenko. Yeah, I was hanging out with Tenko. <laughs> now it's time to show off the mental fortress of Owen through Neo Akito. You do that. Let's spend some time with Tenko. Tenko and I grew a little closer today. You can have this? Thank you! Proper girls show gratitude, even if males are generous, do wrong, the gifts do not. I think I'm regretting this a little bit. I want to ask my past self why I thought it was a good idea to hang out with Tenko. Damn it! No, stop it! Hey. Stop skipping! God damn it! So I fucking hate remote play, but it's the only way to stream this. Backlogs and options. Give me a reaction already, I don't know what else to do. Oh, you don't know what else to do? Tenko, what are you trying to do? <laughs> I'm intimidating you! Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Why do you hate men so much, Tanko? That's a simple enough question. Uh, why? Well, then, no, the love wrath I had brought upon myself. You gotta be kidding me! Of course, you males wouldn't know. You're the worst, lowest, you most evil scum. Ugh. Listen up! The giants always need a reason for everything, don't they? And you don't even know why you're scum because you don't criticize yourself. Master said so, too. As long as there are selfish males, I will never master Neo like at all. Huh? What kind of logic is that? Ugh, are you asking questions males. like that to get closer to me? As I thought. There are no pros to males other than they are born from women. You're the worst of the Can't worst! Can't see I'm looking at you in disgust, but you're still coming closer to me. Why, God, why? Why would you create degenerate males? Girls will be able to live in peace if you degenerates disappear from this world. <laughs> I knew it! Males are actually created by the devil, right? Wait! Tenko. I'm sorry? Sorry. Ugh, but why are degenerate males so... Do you think you can fix it just by apologizing? Such cowardice, I won't allow it! Damn, that's the opposite effect. Hey! Uh, oh, god damn it! Huh? Fucking stop! Stop it! Alright, what the fuck did that. Remote play, you fucking suck! But I can't stream because fucking churn stop said, nah. Tenko! I'm sorry. Ah, uh, wait, 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 just calm down a minute. This is where I made my second mistake, I grabbed her shoulder. Just like a gender male, I knew you'd try and touch me. What? Hey ah! Slam. Uh. Ow, what, why'd you throw me? Ah, uh, you just touched me, didn't you? Wait! Touch you touched me when you threw me! What is this? Yeah, which is technically touching me! Huh? What? I was thrown several more times, blacked out, and then woke up on my bed. What happened? Did Tenko carry me here? Alright, three times over it sounds like. No, night. Night with some fucking steak. It oh, is shit. now night time! The late night special for the exclusive monocap kitchen in Seth Denning Hall is... is all that I'm whipping up a rice bowl with chicken, egg, and spicy kimchi. It's only 1,000 calories. You're on the threshold it's easy to make. Adventure. Just put fried chicken and eggs with rice. Top it with kimchi. Oh, and don't forget the mayo. Voila, bon appetit. By the way... What? This here is for Mana Cubs only. We ain't sharing any with you. I got a fucking steak. Damn! How you like my culinary chaos? So, so long, farewell! Right now, you're on the threshold of an amazing adventure, Shogai. I wouldn't eat that greasy food even if they threatened to kill me. But. Nighttime already, huh? When it gets to be nighttime, I start thinking about things. Was there really no way to save Kaede? I ask myself questions like that. Because no matter how I think about it, what happened to her is my fault. Hmm. I'm so near the doorbell's ringing. Yo! Hey! Come out! Coming out with me for a sec! Huh? Not now, but it's nighttime. Come on. There's man. no rule about walking around at nighttime, right? Huh. I'm a win in the courtyard. Later, dog. Wait. Wait. Hmm. God damn it. Fuck you. Remote play. Wait. <clears throat> Mikado wasn't listening. He turned and quickly walked away. The courtyard at this time of night? What does he want? Could it be about the motor video I have? But how does he know? Wait, should I even go at all? Something might happen. He wants me to come with him. Does he know about the motor video? But if he does, how do he find out? Uh, I'm gonna quickly save. Boop. Thank god this game has a fucking backlog though, right?
Cool AM. Yeah. Fast travel on option? It is not. Alright, let's walk. It's not like it's a long trip, actually, never mind. So we get the courtyards early just outside. Anyone else? Alright, so maids out here, and so is that guy. So let's talk to him. Um Kermie, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. What am I doing? I am returning to my room. Yes, of course. Also, it seems that the rooms of the deceased are now locked. Huh? Really? Yes. Yes, Monica must be responsible for this. It seems as if And Taro in particular seems to have known more than he let on. Perhaps they're sitting in his room that Monica does not wish for us to You're see. Right. Oh, well. Either way. At any rate, we cannot do anything about what has already come to pass. May I? I shall return to my room. I bid you good night, Shuichi. Now let's talk to Kyo. Oh? Oh, are you going out, Shuichi? Okay. Oh, yeah. Kaido asked me to come meet him. Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, yes. I saw him near the West... The Westeries... The Westerarius. The Word. So it was you he was waiting for. Mm -hmm. But having a secret meeting at a time such as this, do you intend to exchange motives? No. I don't know, maybe. He just asked me to meet him. I don't know why. <laughs> I was merely joking, however. However. It would be understandable for one to come to that conclusion. Please keep that in mind. Well, well since I've witnessed you here, I suggest you avoid taking any foolish actions. In any event, good night. I need even more words. Something could happen to me. Well, no, because now you got a guy who knows you're going up to meet Kaido. Something happens to you, and Kaido did it. I mean, like, I mean, I know it's not, but uh, Mage Girl, yeah, I'll talk to you. Here go. Okay. Oh, it's you, Shuichi. Hmm. What are you doing up at this hour? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, just thinking. Hmm. But it's pretty late now. I think I'll sleep well tonight. I knew it. If I knew it'd be like this, I would have had her undo my brainwashing a long time ago. Huh? Your brainwashing? Mm. Good night. Peace. What was that about? She looked happier than a drone. What happened? Yeah, they're exchanging Moda videos. Aren't they? Shuichi, what are you doing up at this hour? Uh, um, oh, well, I have something to do. What are you doing? I... Oh, I would just bring to Ottawa and... <laughs> just be excited for tomorrow. Huh? Tomorrow? Sayonara. Good night, Shuichi. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow, is she playing something? Hey, Kaido. Yo! Oh, good, you came. Uh, What's um... wrong, Kaido? Why'd you call me out here all of a sudden? I mean... See, since I was chosen as a national trainee, I've trained every day, but... I haven't done any training here at all, that's right, I'll get all week, Got so... It. Join me, Shuichi! Huh? What? Why me? All right. Doesn't matter, let's get started, take off your coat! Wait! Wait, why? Shut up! Instead of complying, just do fitting push-ups! I don't know how it happened, but before I knew it... I was doing push-ups with Kaido in the courtyard in the middle of the night. Why? Good boy, so you can think. Have to do this. Now's not the time to use your head. Now's the time to move your body. Mm, from the good. What's the matter? Slowing down already? I never do push-ups. My arms are giving out. Hey, don't say that. The impossible is possible. All you gotta do is make it so. What the? The logic makes no sense. <sighs> Semi managed 50 push ups. But my body was spent. I collapsed on the grass, panting. Jeez. Jeez, that's pathetic, man. You getting time from only 50 push-ups? Got it. Well, that's enough for now. We'll pick back up tomorrow. Huh? We're doing this again tomorrow. Huh? Huh? Well, yeah, you gotta do daily training every day, right? But... 
Well, why do I gotta do this, Kaido? I mean... Because this training's for you. Huh? For me? <laughs> when I look at you, I can't help but get frustrated and ask myself, is the, the one Kaido entrusted her wish to really this week? I mean... You've been holding yourself back since then, haven't you? Do you think Kaido died because you made a wrong deduction? Do you think you killed her? Uh, okay. Yeah, I do, Kaido. Because of my detective work, she set up that. What are you saying? That was all her fault. Listen up. Her sins and her regrets are hers alone. You God damn it! What the fuck did he just say? You only make her. Nope. Fuck you. Remote play. Don't go all the way up there. You'll only make her worry about you if you try and bear all those by yourself. I. I know. Damn it. I know that already. I already know that. You don't have to tell me. But I can't help it, Kaido. I can't stop myself from thinking about what I could have done. It's no use. I'm scared. I try hard not to be, but I'm scared. I can't stop thinking about the pain, the sadness that comes if I reveal the truth. That's what I'm afraid of. Alright! Alright, I got it! So that's your enemy, huh? Huh? Enemy. I mean, well, you gotta deal with the, your worries yourself. I can't give you an answer for those, but but you know, at least you know you're weak. As long as you can admit that, let's do it. Then you'll be okay. Just gotta train and get stronger. Huh? Listen up. Training is the only way to overcome your weakness. But in my case, getting stronger is more of a mental concept. Don't worry about it. Your head and body are connected, right? At the end of the day, they're all the same. What's that even mean? He's not making any sense. Well, maybe that. That's what I need right now. Uh, okay. Uh, all right, Kato, I'll try. No. No, uh, I mean, will you let me? I want to train with you, Kato. You get closer to defeating my enemy. Well said. Bro, but I'm strict, so you better prepare yourself. Nope, you son of a bitch. You son of a bitch remote play. Bro, huh? That's the first time he's called me that. But, uh, perhaps you should be trained too, Kato. Mm -hmm. You talk big for a guy that only did 20 push-ups. What? You were counting? Jeez. Jeez, even though it's that, yes you are the only detective after all. But you know. The goal was just 50 anyway, so it doesn't matter if I'm a few short. Well, that's not fair at all. And thus, Kaido and I began our training regimen. I don't really know why Kaido's concerned about me, but I suppose I can trust someone again. Just this time. I decided to trust Kaido, and he's gonna die. Isn't he? I decided to trust Kaido and his craziness. I really don't want to though. Kaido, Kaido's like my favorite character. I like him more than Shuichi. Kaido's mm. literally my favorite. I'm so tired. I worked out for the first time in a long while. I'm completely exhausted. But, it's a good kind of exhausted. Mm. Now, for sleep. I didn't want any intrusive thoughts that night. As soon as I had to hit the pillow, I fell into a deep, relaxing sleep. And at the time, I didn't yet realize. Just how horrific it can be to trust someone in this place. Yeah, either he's gonna kill someone or he's gonna get killed. Hello, Jaws. I'm saying, what are you guys looking at? Who, who are you guys? Everything in the killing game is taking forever, so just die already. That is what you're thinking, right? Well, you guys screwed us. But I feel the same way too. Jeez, why would someone just die? Watch people live and die is really the best entertainment. Some people say, what do you think of life is? Honestly, life is worthless. When you die, you're equipped with guns, cause there's tons of replacements out there. But if you die in a death game, everyone knows who you are. That itself is a form of happiness. Who will find happiness next? My heart's pounding with excitement. I imagine we're probably gonna see a death today. Neither. Kaido, you better be fine. You better not be the killer or killed. I want Kaido to last. I know Kaido won't, but I want Kaido to last till the end. He's not going to, though, because of our fucking best friend in this, so he's doomed. I said that by I mean fucking, uh. Check from the first game, Ultimate, that Ultimate Detective. Fucking got out fine. Rise and shine, Ursine! Mm -hmm. Yum yum! This is an official announcement for the Ultimate Academy! It is now 8 a.m. Time to wake up, yum yum. Dumbass! What are you eating? It's fine. It is okay. What do you mean? What's okay? It is now 8 a.m. 
Everybody wake up, unless you are dead, then disregard. So then, two. So long, farewell! <laughs> My body hurts. Muscles were still sore from working out, but because of that, <sighs> I had a good night's sleep for the first time in a while. Perhaps in the first full night's sleep since I got here. All right. Breakfast. Eating good breakfast became part of my daily routine. <clears throat> no, Shuichi. Ah, oh. oh, Ryoma, are you heading to the dining hall? No. If I went there the way I am now, I just ruined the mood. Hey. Listen. I can't begin to imagine what your life has been like. And I know that this is gonna sound cliche, okay. but you shouldn't give up on life. If you keep living, I'm sure good things will happen. <laughs> good things, mm. But good things are when your wishes, hopes, and dreams are fulfilled, right? What does that have to do with someone like me with no wishes, hopes, or dreams? Uh, but um, more importantly. Did something happen to you? Huh? Sheesh. You haven't noticed? It looked completely different from yesterday. <laughs> It's like your eyes have stopped focusing on the past. <laughs> your face looks more dependable. Your speech was low and melancholy. He turned and walked away. Uh, okay. Stop focusing on the past? <laughs> Guess they kind of had circle and leave there. Who's over here? Eh, Mental Girl can wait. Also, didn't I find like another dining hall door like over here somewhere? Yeah, here. Coolio. I poured into my calculations, not everyone is gathered today. I suppose so. You can see that without doing any calculations. Jeez. Jeez, what everyone else is doing? It seems as if. It seems Maki has chosen to spend all her time inside her ultimate research lab. <clears throat> I'm not sure what she's doing in there. But she has no intention of leaving. Maki was Emma. <clears throat> All right. I haven't seen her a lot, so I could, I, her name is going to get me a bit. What was that? <clears throat> What's a child care? a guy doing a research lab, anyways. Maybe she's hiding a bunch of kids in there that she's secretly taking care uh, of. Um, she's not some stray dog on the streets raising pups. Um, I also saw Kokoichi and Punta speaking around together, or sneaking around. Ah! Uh, a couple of virgins sneaking around sounds like bad news to me. Hey. Ah, I saw Ryoma on my way here, but he wasn't coming up today. Hmm. I see. Well, we don't need that guy around here. Until he's got his head on straight. <laughs> How the famous Ryoma Hoshi end up like that? What, the famous Ryoma Hoshi? M moving along. What are those two doing? What is that? Long oh, No. Um, uh, what are you guys doing? Prayer time! 
Brain to Ottawa, of course. Mm. Brain to Ottawa. <laughs> you too, Himiko! <laughs> as long as I pray like this, I don't need to waste my energy on useless stuff. No matter what happens or what trouble lies ahead, my heart will be calm. I'll commit that to my memory bank. I see. It's escapism. That's not right! No! She has merely abandoned reality to speak to Ottawa! Actually... That is escapism. Oh, my. Really? I didn't know that! You gotta be kidding me! Hey, Angie! When did you brainwash Himiko? <laughs> On the contrary, I've undone her brainwashing. Mm. I was brainwashed before. Back when I didn't feel the presence of Ottawa. <laughs> it seems it's too late. Himiko! Please get a hold of yourself! You have to face reality! Please! Yay! Himiko! Himiko! Stop it. Stop it. And you're up to me, it messes up my calm heart. I, I remember this nightmare reality I'm in. Uh, all my insecurities and loneliness, the pain that, that made me want to die. Here! Sheesh, a tentacle! Don't interrupt Himiko while she is praying! Then smiling as always, Angie walked up to Himiko and... I understand, Himiko. You're not actually scared, you're just sad, aren't you? You feel frustrated, anxious, and worried, but you have no one to confide in, do you? It's okay. You're not alone, Himiko. I know a handsome god who is keeping a watchful eye on you. Uh, a handsome god? Ah! Yeah, what a mysterious miracle. I'm not scared anymore. Thanks, b to Atua. Ah, how wonderful. It's all thanks to handsome god. Hi! My speaking pattern has changed again. Huh? What handsome god? Wait, Himiko, you like handsome men? Why can't it be me? Yeah. Are you playing for the other team? Uh uh -huh. What are you talking about? It's nothing like that! Hey, Angie! What did you do to Himiko? Huh? What did I do? A I did something! I did! What did I do? Yeah, yeah. Uh, God damn it! Fucking stop! I wanna read what the fuck people say. Oh, yes, yes! Atu has spoken to me! I shall convey his message to everyone! Where is this conversation going? Anyway, what is Adwa's message concerns me a little? I feel like it's like a micro- uh, fucking microphone in her ear that Monokuma's speaking to. I hope that's it. Hey! Angie, what are these divine messages? And I can be like one of the murders where he tells her to kill someone, so she does. Uh... Adwa says this academy suffers from the same sins as the outside world! You're all unhappy because your greed is making you treat others like adversaries! Adua has spoken. Your desire to leave this place is only worsening your greed. Uh, um, greed? Cause Atua says so. So we must cast aside that sinful greed and rejoice in our new lives here. So you are saying we should live here for the rest of our lives? No, no. That's wrong. How divine! It's not enough to simply live here forever. Our lives must also be full of divine purpose. In other words, see? we must make this academy heaven on earth. What? And then? In doing so, our desire to leave will vanish and the killings will cease. That's... Are you being super serial right now? Because... This place provides us always shelter, food, clothing, and the wonderful bread. get punished. What more could you possibly desire? Do not give in to greed. What? Kimiko! Did you hear that nonsense? Snap out of it! Get out! Oh, those divine messages are never wrong. Huh? Uh, yep. Himiko is good girl and fast learner. And then... Together we devised a truly divine plan. <laughs> the plan shall ever to help us live lives of fulfillment here. The best plan? <laughs> Tell them Himiko! Everyone! Make them fast with happiness. <laughs> Explode with excitement. It's finally happening. Great, huh? The amazing Himiko's magic show is finally opening. <gasps> A magic show? <laughs> Don't worry, admission is- Oh, well, actually, since it's happier. Don't worry, admission is free, or exact- uh, Actually, I guess admission will just be a smile. Mm -hmm. Over 
the years, my show has given many smiles to people with broken hearts. Now is the time to demonstrate my powers. With my magic. Is the only thing that can heal your twisted heart. Hmm. But in our current predicament, performing magic tricks is quite illogical. Stop it. Don't disturb my concentration. You gotta learn to read the mood already. And it's called a magic show because I do magic, not tricks. Screw your magic show! I don't get excited about that crap! Hey, You're way too excited! And the show opens tomorrow morning. Come to the gym after the morning announcement. And that's probably where the actual death's gonna happen. Then, chances bring it tomorrow, that means not today, most likely. You guys better get excited and look forward to what anticipation. Say. Surely you mean anticipation? Or have I misunderstood the nature of this show? No, then. Imago and I will begin the prep work, and I'm supposed to ask Ada to help too! Bye, I'm counting on you guys to help. Nyahaha. <laughs> Bye, Yonara! <laughs> Farewell. Later, bitches. After announcing their show, before anyone could react, Himiko and Angie left the dining hall. Himiko? Hey, Himiko, what happened to her? Oh, dear. <laughs> Faith, this is intense. This can be quite terrifying. <laughs> there may be no concern for... There may be no cause for concern. This does not appear to be related to our motive videos. Come on, man. You're only worried about that? I'm worried. Of course, we cannot afford to take Monica's motives lightly. What? But everyone who's in here could be showing each other videos, right? The fuck you just say? <clears throat> you mean Kakuichi Gonta and Ryoma? Um, I'm going to my dear if someone tells them to. I don't. Ryoma definitely is. Ryoma's Oda, right? I think Oda's Ryoma. No, Kokuichi is, right? Ryoma was. Oh, Ryoma was fucking black haired girl, right? No. Who the fuck was Ryoma? Oh, him. No, he definitely isn't. Kokuichi might be, though. Nope, oh, stop it. Stop it. God damn it, what the fuck do they. That's a lot of shit to read. No, I don't think that's it. Even with three people, there's a low probability of them each having each other's motive videos. Seems unlikely that one of them would show a motive video without seeing their own in return. So I don't think a video exchange in a small group like that is likely. I see. That is true. Heh! <laughs> Not bad! That's the ultimate detective for you! Yeah. Um... I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. That goes the same for Angie and Himiko. G give Himiko back! What do you think? But now, for now, let us have some breakfast, shall we? I have prepared meals for everyone. Of course, I will deliver meals to those who are not currently present. Ah. Ah, I don't gotta do that, I'll eat their portions. Ah! <laughs> Kaido, don't push yourself too hard. After I helped and stuffed Kaido to his room, I returned to my own. Kokuichi and Gonta, Angie and Himiko, and Ryoma and Maki too. Oh god damn it! Fuck you! Seriously, this is just a piece of shit. God damn it, Spike turns off. Why the fuck would you do this? Everyone's all over the place, but I shouldn't just leave them be. There has to be something I can do. Yes, I'm about to do something about this. Alright, what presents we got? Anything obvious?
Well, let's give the fun book of animals to fucking go to. Let's see how that works out. I'm not going to use a bug person, not animal person, but it's the closest person to animals I can think of. in his fucking yeah. Oh shit, so is Oda. Luigi, I don't gather in dining hall, right? Gunta think about going, but Kokuichi say he wanna strategize meeting with Gunta. Yeah, I think I was Gunta. But oh, but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you wanna you want Gunta shoot Luigi? I don't mind. Go ahead and take him off my hands, okay? Weird. Don't talk like that. Gunta not the property. So what should we do? You can pick Luigi. I spent some time with Gunta. Going to make a little close today. Would you like to give Gunta a present? Yeah. I'm sound. I don't think he'll be the biggest fan of it, but he's the only one I can think of that would like use it. Thank you. What for Gunta? Thank you, Shuichi. Or I guess he did kind of like it. Gunta not get gifts often. Gunta happy, very, very happy. Thank you. Thank you, Shuichi. Huh? huh? For what? Hey. For inviting Gunta. Gunta very, very happy. This may be first time Gunta spend free time with anyone. So Gunta will work hard. Treat Shuichi like a true gentleman. It's not true though. Uh, we give you that before. So we've hung out with you before. Maybe no. as a... Uh, I think that was as Kaede though. Ah, it's okay Gunta. You don't have to be so intense. Just talk is fine. No. No, it's not fine. Shuichi invented Gunta! Um... But, but what should we do for fun? Think Gunta, think. Oh yeah! Oh. Gunta, no. Come, we race! Huh? Race? Hey! Gunta good at running. Running full speed through forest so much fun. Plus, feel good to run like wild. Maybe a nice change of pace. He claims to be a dumb, but now he wants to race. Okay. Alright, Gunta, if you want to race, let's race. Mm. Okay, then let's go. Gunta grabbed my hand and pulled me firmly in as I ran along behind him. Wait! Gonta, you're running too fast! I forgot that Gonta was raising the wild, of course, he's athletic. See? Not yet! To run like wind, you got to run way faster! Uh. What are you talking about? I was being dragged along by Gunta, I began to trip over my feet. Exhausted, I began to stagger, and unlucky, the stairs to the basement were right there. Oh, I'm gonna fall! This big problem! Joichi? I was going to shout and felt my body being pulled uh. back. Whoa! Gundy yanked me back towards him when, we, when I hit his chest, we both fell over. Or so I thought Gundy even flinched when I hit him. You alright? Thank you. Don't fuck you. Yeah. I saw Shuichi okay? Ah, no, I'm okay. That was close. Thank you for saving me. No thank Gunta. Gunta makes Shuichi run. This all Gunta's fault. Sorry, Gunta not very fun after all. I had fun. Hey! No, Gunta, I had fun! Really? Okay. Of course, it's been a long time since I've had to run that fast. It felt good in a way. A nice change of pace. Wow! Oh, then Gunta, glad Juichi had fun! Uh, um, Gunta? Hey! Let's do this again sometime. The next time I need another change of pace. Got it! Okay, then Gunta, wait. Invite Gunta anytime! Gunta, do anything for Juichi. Gunta, protect you like a gentleman! God damn it! Fucking share play. Gunta's bringing positivity, Gunta's really is pure. Smiling myself at Gunta's innocence, I return to my room. There's still some time left. Huh, 
I guess that's Kaido, but is he here to train already? Are we supposed to train tonight? It's a little early. Shit, connection's dropping. What the f- Come on, don't go left. I wanna save. In case you guys how I'm saving, I'm saving each chapter. So, you know. You can see the differences of how long it took me. The moment then, the moment I opened the door. Shuichi, run! Huh? huh? What happened? Damn. Don't just stand there, run! Hurry, he's coming! What happened? Who's coming? What? Katarista glanced in the hallway and immediately stepped up in fear. Damn it! He's already here! Hurry, Shuichi, run! Shuichi! We both made it out of this alive! Let's train again! Ah! Uh. Kato! Kato gave his ominous warning, then ran away at lightning speed. What? Who are you talking about? Speak to the gap in the door and discover what Kaido is so terrified by. Huh? That's Gonta, isn't it? He looks different. What's going on? Looks like he's checking each room. He'll be at my door soon. I don't know what he's up to, but it's probably better not to be here. Kaido killed a bug, didn't he? Careful to avoid alerting Gonta, I quickly tiptoed down the hall. I stealthily made my way to the courtyard. Kaido killed a bug. What was that all about? What was Gonta up to? Yeah. From the looks of it, you ran away from Gonta too. Uh, Ryoma! What now? I don't know why, but it seems like he's gone into a rage and is trying to catch everyone. He was charging right at me at top speed. Huh? He threw himself right at you, but he managed to get away? That's amazing. Yeah, yeah I used the Shukuichi method. A technique from my tennis day. It's like a flash step, you know? Of course, I've gotten rusty since back in the day, You've but... Still got a ways to go. So he won't be able to catch me like that. Shukuichi, Ryoma must have been an incredible player back in the day. By the way... Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm cool with you. For saying something so cool, like, I have no reason to live. Huh? Alright, uh, no, you don't have to apologize. Yeah. I'm gonna say this so we're clear. I'm not so stupid that I'd waste my life. I only said that, like, I only said something like that because I was jealous of you. Why? Jealous? Yeah. If I had a stronger attachment to life, I could try my best alongside you all. <laughs> Suddenly, Ryoma ducked down, taking cover. When I looked around to find what had scared Ryoma, I saw... There you are. Hey, where are you going? Huh? Gonta? Sorry, Shuichi, but I'm gonna run. I've still got things I need to do. No! Gonta no can let you leave. Sorry, but it's for your own good. I'm gonna charge us like a runaway train and then... I lost consciousness. No, God damn it! Fucking piece of shit. I didn't even feel the impact, I didn't have time to scream, my world went turned dark, and in this pitch black and world I thought to myself, this is what it's like to die. I can't die yet! Oh, that was Ryoma, wasn't it? Oh, hey, Oda. Morning, sleepyhead! You're finally up, Shuichi. Huh? What? Me? <laughs> Are you gonna ask, who am I? And where am I? Well, you're definitely Shuichi Saihara. And this place is... Hmm... I guess hell. Hell? I shook my head confused. I looked around. Hmm... Is this... Uh -huh. Oh, you're awake. This is the Ultimate Entomologist Research Lab. Huh? The ultimate entomologist lab. Why? Oh. Oh, I remember the tech by Gonta, and That's then the same is true for the rest of us. We were all seized by Gonta and brought here. Um. But you is the only one who got knocked out. By the way, Gonta apologized for that. Apparently, he couldn't slow down in time when he tried to grab you. Why? 
What is this anyway? Why did Gunta do this? Oh my. It's because of that guy. He was provoked by that guy. My follower Sumagi was pointing. <laughs> There's no need trying to escape. Gunta will just catch you again. No. This is you doing, Kokuichi. Why do you have Gunta kidnap us? <laughs> He's so simple-minded. Mm. Says I told everyone who hates bugs was trying to get rid of them. He started crying and said that he would get you guys to love bugs or something like that. So that means... That's why we're all here. Welcome to the mandatory insect meet and greet. Oh, Kunta thought the name. So if you don't like it, why should you complain to him? terrible. You tricked Kunta. Right. Isn't it great? Only an evil supreme leader like me can do something so evil. Kokichi... Why are you doing this? Ah. Oh, I thought we could give ourselves a little screening party with all our videos. See? Without you, exchange our motivators won't be that difficult at all. <laughs> now we'll see your videos too, so I figure we can all binge watch them together. Please, wait. Do you know what will happen if you do that? Um, eh, everyone will know their motive, and a killing, a killing will more likely be able to happen. But... But I like playing a mean difficulty only. Also, I don't run from battles and RPGs either. Yo, my man. High five. I want to win killing game, so I'm not going to run for it, I'm going to crush it. How exciting. That'll be way less boring, don't you think? Huh? What the hell does that even mean? See? I tried to warn you guys. I told you that we shouldn't cooperate with each other. <laughs> also, this is my voice now. Plus, if I'm going to do this, then I got to enjoy myself and get it all the way. If uh, the thought of playing a death game doesn't excite you, you'll never win, understand? Strange I could check no evil in a smile as I said that. It was an end smile, like a frolicking child. Although perhaps it's just another lie. Hey! Thank for waiting! Gunta bring Himiko and Anji! What? Huh? Himiko and Anji too? Aww. Oh Ming, you know I was about to take a break too. I just finished all the paperwork. Mm. What's the meaning of that? Himiko, are you alright? My saliva makes injuries heal faster. Piece of cake. The, no, God it. damn it! Fuck you, uh, share play. Just face it. Do you want me to spit on your face and make it better? No. Hey, Gunta! Are these the only ones you brought back to the gym? No, from the gym? Mm -hmm. Oh, Kurumi at the gym, but she too, Gunta, she too busy. Mm -hmm. And you just. Let her go? Atua has spoken. Atua said, Karumi, fulfill any request I want to make of her, like a mommy. Hey. Uh, she's not a mom though, wait, what request? Uh... I request that she suit the curtains. I don't think even Gunta can disturb her. Sorry. Sorry, not gu not even Gunta strong enough to overcome mm -hmm. Karumi. Mm -hmm. mm, well, I guess at least one of you is worthy of being called an ultimate. By the way. Well, nothing we can do about her. So, where are the other side? Um... Oh, Kunta see me, but Kunta's face gets red hot, so Kunta can, no can bring her. Mm -hmm. Your face gets hot? What were you hot on her trail, right? <laughs> um, no, she used her, what she call it, secret woman weapon, and then... What? Anyway, this is enough people, right? Insect meet and greet is off to smashing stars. Maybe? Yeah, sure, this is good enough. We should move on to the main event anyway. <laughs> Kunta, don't be deceived. He just wants you to abduct us all. <gasps> Huh? Really? Uh-uh. No. God damn it. God fucking damn it. No! This is for the insect meat and greed. I like bugs you more than you do, Gunta. Oh? More than Gunta? Amazing. You like bugs that much? It would appear further argument is a useless endeavor. Hey, hey! Now, Gunta, go and teach them how wonderful bugs are. I gotta run there and I'll be right back. Don't let them leave, okay? Alright! They try and leave, it means you gotta really show my bugs are so great. Mm. Got this. Could it be. Well, wait, you're leaving? Yeah. Of course! Someone's gotta break into your rooms and get the goods. <laughs> Lock picking is a cinch for an evil supreme leader like me. Wait, don't you just heard you say that? What the fuck is this? What? Huh, are you gonna enter a girl's room without permission? I must. It seems I must be the one to take care of this with my talent, Kokoichi. I will You're stop. You're so dumb. Yeah, yeah, don't try to listen to some robot. Um, Let's see, it's exactly 9 p.m. right now. I, I should be back by night time. Well, have some fun with the bug. Till then! Later, bitches! Kokoichi then left the classroom. <laughs> it appears we are caught in Kokoichi's trap. What should we do? What should we do at this rate? It'll end up as a motive video screening party. Uh -huh. 
Yeah. My, my Neo Akita is no match for Gold and Superhuman Strength either. Everyone. We still have a chance when Kokoichi comes back. That's when I will take care of this. Everyone, please just endure it until then. Huh? Endure it? Everyone, play nice. Okay, now it's a fun, fun insect meeting greet. When I first woken up, Kokoichi told me this was hell. It appears that wasn't a lie. The incredible specimens each gave off the appearance of vigor and vitality. And they were exactly as vigorous as they looked. As our escape route blocked off, we all always just run around the room in a panic. And then Tim and some play, but didn't save us. The insect may angry contained without mercy. What happened, Kokichi? You said you'd be back by night time. Ah, oh no! Himiko was being the latex! Himiko, hold on! The more you yell, the more bugs can get into your mouth. <laughs> Wait, when our prize were completely exhausted and sleep was nearly upon us. He finally came back. Whoa! Oh, the bugs ever! How nice! I mean, how nice! Oh! Oh, you come back, Coco Witchy. Come, have fun! Everyone, please! We're play nice. gonna have so much fun! Mm. You know, as much as I'd love to do that, maybe we should call it a day, hmm? See? The bugs are really tired, and a gentleman knows to do things in moderation, you know? You're right! Oh, going to understand. Hey, hey. So you can apply to your pins with the others. Kukuchi's hands are full of several cup pads. God damn it! Alright, what the fuck did everyone just say? That went through quite a few. You guys ready? I look drowned as we're at. Cause you're late. You said you'd be back by night, but it's already 11 p.m. now. Sorry, I'm into an unexpected snafu, but look. <laughs> Cubs pads! God, gotta catch them all! I even got the pads belonging to the people who aren't here. <laughs> Now we can watch the motor video! Oh my! You say we don't want to. How exciting! Well, it's late, and I'm getting sleepy, so let's start hey. already. Start the what? Well, you know. Oh, don't worry about it, Gunda. Just keep watching these guys don't. That's enough. That's it. I won't let you do as you please. I also... I didn't want to use this unless I absolutely had to. It eats up a lot of my electricity. We must do But it. that's neither here nor there. I will stop you right here, right now. Huh? Kiba, what are you about to, going to do? So glaring, Kokuichi, Kiba slowly reached a hand behind his ear. And spun the mechanical parts He's there. Up? Is he gonna self destruct or. Huh? What's that sound? One moment, please. I'm rewinding the tape right now. The tape? Right. Oops. Right there. Kiba shouted out as and pushed his palm against his ear. That's when. Is this your doing, Kokichi? Did you have Gonta kidnap us? Was that my voice? <laughs> He's so simple-minded. As soon as I told him that everyone who hates bugs was trying to get rid of them, he started crying and said that he would get you guys to love bugs. Or something like that. Could this be... How about this? So what do you think? You just saw my audio recording function for the first time. What? Did we just whip out an audio recording like that's some secret weapon? Excellent. Really? It's a cassette tape? In this day and age? Huh? But it's metal tape, you know. Wait, why? The sound quality isn't the issue. Hmm? Well, let's put, just put that aside now. More importantly, it seems to have worked. Kokoichi! What do you mean? You know like bugs! Oh, 
Man, now it's boring. It you say we get them to understand how amazing bugs are? Was that a lie? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't lie to you. I love bugs. From the bottom of my heart. All right. Oh, so it's not lie. Then go into happy. Let's have fun with bugs all night. Hey, bugs! Who wants to pet more bugs? Uh, Everyone! We must run while we still can. <gasps> Wait! I need to take back our cup's pet first! Oof. Ah, and then we all run out of the lab. Uh, fuck it. I think we got the gist of all that was. After leaving the room, I could still hear the muffled buzzing Kokoichi screaming. Hmm. We might be corpses by tomorrow morning. It's plain to see. Don't talk about that. What if it happens? It's just plain possible. Um, so what? How, so how do we return these cub pads back to the rightful owners? Jeez. Hmm. If only the Manu cubs were here. Oh, I'm sure they'd help us. Babe. Hmm. Oh, it's just you. It's fine. The others are asleep. If you need something, I can help you. Uh. Ah, uh, hmm. it's what the mo the cups patch. Look which you brought them all to us, and I simply need to return them. I will return each of your res each one to your respective rooms, you bastards. Ah, uh. ah, he left. Well, how's it, bro? He returned. So I'm gonna have mine again. He, he returned what? them all to the actual people. But out of all of them, we can probably trust that one, right? Well then. Shall we go back to our dorm? It is well past night time. <laughs> That's true! We have the magic show tomorrow! You're right. Because of all this, we couldn't do a rehearsal, but I'm sure it'll be a divine show. Yaha! We'll be waiting for you to come watch! <laughs> <laughs> we'll be raiding, she says! It's Himiko's show, not yours! Uh, um... I suppose it's alright. I remembered I wasn't able to turn Kaido, Kaido today. Ah, too bad. We can do it tomorrow, though, right? It's not like I'll never see him again or something. God damn it. You had to say that. Worn out from all the commotion, we dragged ourselves back to our rooms. I wonder if Kaido's dead. I don't know. Hmm. It's close to midnight now. Tomorrow's a busy day. I should get some sleep. I collapsed onto the bed and quickly fell asleep. I need a miracle! You can pray, right? While you're walking, living, and gambling? But well, miracles happen every day! For example, do you know what the odds of the Earth's existing are? The same as a tornado blowing through a junkyard and assembling a working car. That's a miracle! That's why us being alive on Earth is a miracle! All kinds of miracles happen every day! Life is made up of little miracles! But what happens a miracle does happen? It just gets chalked up as fate or destiny or whatever! Be grateful for the miracles that have already happened, instead of hoping for new ones! If you do that, you should be able to enjoy miracles, right? Peace, bitches! I'm fucking Manu Kuma! Rise and shine or sign! And shiner sign. It's now 8 a.m. Fun. Ah. Oh, he left. Monosuka is so impatient. Mm. He's been cranky lately, so it's making him impatient. Mm. I don't like impatient men. Get along. I want to get along with Monosuka. By the way, I got a new voice chip. I kind of like it. All right. It's early, but I'll go ahead and do the 
time announcement to And that's that. 10 p.m. later. <laughs> it's too early! Your patience is trying to warp time and space! So long. Farewell. I am not happy, bears. Hmm. Yes, they have human because magic show. But the insect fiasco I did now this. Do we all tend to be doing well. this stuff? Well, I suppose I shouldn't think about it too much. I'll just go to the gym for now. And not see Kaido, because Kaido is dead. He's not gonna be there. It's fucking... Kaido. I just wanna check Kaido's room. Smash is going on in the gym, right? Let's go watch. No, we should fucking make sure Kaido's okay. Because you fucking jinxed him yesterday. Damn it, you're not Kaido, so I don't care. Kaido! You better be in the fucking gym and alive! Alright, Kibo, you will actually talk to. Kibo! Ah, Kibo, good morning. Yes. Good morning, Shuichi. How are you feeling today? Are you still sore from the events of last night? Okay. Ah, I'm fine. Are you alright? Yes, I'm fine. I've recharged the electricity that I use in my recording function. Even so, I'm very happy that I was finally able to use my functions to help everyone. Gives your recording function. It's not exactly revolutionary technology, but it did help a lot. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Kiba. You really earned the telephone. Well, of course. Robot. Oh, it was nothing, really. If you need my help for anything, please don't hesitate to ask. <laughs> yeah, sure, I will. Um, so, the magic show is starting soon, yes? Everyone is probably gathered in the gym already. We should get going as well. Alright, I'm just gonna go. I'm not gonna fast travel just because it's Kaido on the way! Because he better be okay! I'll be very sad if he's not! Hey. Whoop! Kaido! Kaido, senpai! He's dead, he's not here, he's dead. Whoa. This is even ever nicer than I thought it'd be. Yeah. Welcome to our magic show! What do you think? Isn't it divine? Okay. Yeah, it is. I don't think you guys have a real stage set up. Did you and Himiko do all this? No, no. This would have been impossible with just two people. I got the others to help us. Yeah, that's right. Kaito and Kibo helped to carry equipment from Himiko's research lab. I designed the stage, but Rumi sued the curtain. Thanks, b 2 2 Everyone is so nice. I thought deserve all credit. No. Ah, shouldn't everyone who worked on it get the credit? Oh. oh, well, I didn't ask you to help because I didn't know what you'd be useful for. That's... Did you really have to say that? I don't know, I don't anyway, know. Anyway, just a tight. Once we're done preparing, we start right away. So preparing, you're not ready yet? Uh, yep. The start of the show needs to settle our nerves. The start of the show requires mental preparation. <laughs> Shaking like a leaf. Stick with Kyo. Say, those fish in the tanks above are those truly? Is it right to use something so dangerous? Yeah, piranhas. Could it be? I'm go. You a bit nervous? Just a little bit. Certainly doesn't look like just, 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 just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Because the magic, I'll be performing today is the Extreme Water Magic Underwater Escape Act. I've never successfully cast it before. It's pretty difficult, so I'm a little nervous. Huh? You've never cast it before? Mm. And today is in order to raise the stakes. Mm -hmm. There's a time limit. If I don't escape from the tank within the time limit, Piranhas will be dropped in. I'll be pureed. Pureed? This is looking a little dangerous. 
The water is cloudy, so I can't really see it clearly, but I do see fish swimming around. Those are all piranhas, huh? They don't look all they don't look like normal piranhas. Mm -hmm. well, those piranhas were in my research lab. I just said we could we should use them for the show. Uh, no. Well wait, piranhas are way too dangerous. Uh. Ah, Denko. Emiko. Emiko, please reconsider. They're piranhas, they're not they're nothing like lasagna. My magic. No need to worry. I'll instantly kill all the piranhas with my magic. Huh? You're gonna kill them? I thought that was an escape trick. Um Emiko, are you serious? There's no way I can stop now, since Atu is watching the show and all. No! There's no such thing as Atua! And she has brainwashed you! What was that? I don't believe in my magic. Well, I, I can do it. I'm a skilled young girl, because I'm a mage. She psyched herself up and headed straight to the water tank. <laughs> of course I believe in your magic here, my precious friend, and she dies. Tenko. Yoo-hoo! Ready, Himako? Did you say your prayers and use the bathroom? <sighs> I said my prayers and went pee. So one thing's gonna happen is the prawn is gonna be released early and then that's the kill. And Kaido's dead too. <laughs> They're gonna be like, oh, Kaido dead. And then, they, then we find Kaido dead. Then let's get the show started! It's starting already, but everyone's not here. Maki, Kakuichi, Ryoma, and Kaido aren't here, because Kaido's dead. What happened to Kaido? I thought I'd be here for sure. wonder if something happened. Yeah, something did happen. Death. Thank you, Atua, for being with us today. Boo! Boo! You're supposed to thank us first! Ha 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 ha! I present to you the mysterious, the miraculous, the amazing... Sweet Dad Himiko! The magic I will perform today is the extreme water magic. Uh, uh, underwater escape act. If you would please turn your attention to the water tank in front of you. When the timer above the stage starts, Himiko will enter the water tank. Once she's in the tank, her assistant, me, will draw the curtain in front of the tank. After 60 seconds have passed on the timer, a separate suspended tank will open and drop in a school of piranhas! Oh my goodness! After the piranhas have fallen and the curtain is opened, if by some miracle Himiko has been gobbled up, please give a big round of applause! Just kidding! It's a joke! No, it's not because it's going to happen. Himiko is fucked. Are you feeling all right? I'm concerned. I'm concerned about Himiko. She's not responding properly to Angie's jokes. Mm. Gunta worry. Gunta have bad feeling. <laughs> Atua, please protect Hime. No. Wait, what am I doing? Bring to Atua. That's Angie's stick. Oh. Well, I guess you could pray to some other god. Yeah. Well then, let's begin. The amazing Himiko's magic show! Alright, let's see her die. In a typical high pitch voice, Himiko made her announcement start the timer. Then she took a breath and dove into the water tank. Okay! I'm closing the curtain! And she closed the curtain, obscuring the water tank from view. We stared silently, waiting. I clenched my fist nervously, my palms. Damp with sweat. Himiko is still not out! She went in mere moments ago. W well, do you think she's alright? Uh, Gonta's starting to worry. Should we do something? Yes! She she still hasn't come out! Are you sure she's okay? G Gonta can't take it anymore! Gonta cried out, leaped out of his seat, and. Wait, Gonta? Ran up onto the stage. Do that? We're still in the middle of the show! Gonta, good! B but if Gonta does nothing, piranhas will eat Himiko! Well, that's raw that's a different subtitle, but yeah. Huh? Um, less than ten seconds remain. I don't care if it ruins the trick! Just come out! This stress is bad for my heart! Himiko! 
right when the timer hit zero, the buzzer went off. And then... bottom of the suspended tank swung open the murky water and shadowy shapes inside. The strand of the water tank, Himiko was swimming huh? in. Huh? Look! The piranhas! H hurry! The curtains! Open the curtains already! Got it! I'm opening it now! When did you pull apart the curtains? We witnessed some an unbelievable sight. What the shit? No! I liked him! Holy shit! Oh fuck! I'm excited for this one actually! Shit! Someone I cared about is really dead! Fuck! I mean, hey. At least it's not Kaido. Right?